we will learn about the concept of de-challenge and re-challenge in pharmacovigilance. What is de-challenge? De-challenge refers to stopping of the drug, usually after an adverse event or at the end of a planned treatment. De-challenge may be complete or partial, that is, when the drug is completely stopped or the dose is decreased. Adverse event may fully disappear or only partially decrease. What is meant by positive de-challenge? Positive de-challenge refers to an adverse event disappearing after stopping the drug. Also, please note, in cases where a withdrawal reaction is experienced, a de-challenge is when the drug is again given to the patient. On similar lines, what is negative de-challenge? Negative de-challenge refers to the adverse event not disappearing after the stopping of the drug. Let us understand the concept of de-challenge using examples. Imagine Tony has taken ibuprofen for his headache and he develops a rash. If the rash disappears after stopping ibuprofen, it is positive de-challenge. However, if the rash persists after stopping ibuprofen, it is negative de-challenge. Now, we will learn what is re-challenge. Re-challenge refers to the restarting of the same drug after having stopped it. Stoppage is usually due to an adverse event, like de-challenge. Re-challenge can also be partial or complete. Now, we will learn about positive and negative re-challenge. Let us understand this by means of an example. Imagine Maria has taken ibuprofen for a headache. Following this, Maria develops a rash. This rash disappears after stopping ibuprofen. Now, imagine Maria again taking ibuprofen. If the rash reappears, it is positive re-challenge. However, if Maria does not develop rash after restarting ibuprofen, it is negative re-challenge. What is positive re-challenge? This refers to adverse event recurring after restarting the drug. On similar lines, what is negative re-challenge? This occurs when the adverse event does not recur after restarting the drug. Why is the concept of de-challenge, re-challenge important? 1. It is very important in causality assessment. A positive de-challenge or re-challenge may suggest strong causal relationship. One also needs to apply this concept while processing adverse events in a safety database. Feel free to reach us in case you have any questions. Also, please subscribe to our channels.